Go to your side. How's it going guys? Welcome back to another episode of Climbing Vlog. Today we're going to be heading over to Horse Flats. I've never been there before, so we'll see how things go. So we're just about to head up into what looks like the mountain area where we'll be. The map says about 40 more minutes of driving till we get there, but uh, hopefully it'll be cool. I don't have a guidebook for the area, so I'll be using Mountain Project on my phone, and hopefully that will suffice. So I went to the wrong area to park. Um, does, there was no uh, easy way of getting up to the boulders, which are out there somewhere. But I'm going to try a different route. Hopefully I'll figure out how to get to these boulders. So I'm still not there. I found this sign ahead that says Horse Flats Campground one and based off of what I'm seeing on Google Maps it looks like one mile until we get to the horse flats campground so I'm gonna turn around again and park there should be able to get to the boulders from there so wish me luck so basically I think I'm in the right area as I was driving I ran into somebody that I know who was driving in the opposite direction I'm just gonna follow you. Are you just gonna follow me? Yeah. Alright. Like right up here to the left. So I ran into Dylan, aka Climberisms. So now we're gonna climb together. And even better news, I found Horse Flats Campground. So now we're on the way to uh, the Horse Flats Campground. So we just made it to the parking lot area. Now we're gonna climb together. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> Gotta hike up there somewhere. Ooh, I see a trail down there. There is a trail to go around all this. So we just made it to the campground area. We took a gamble earlier and tried to walk along the trail that we parked at to get to the boulders and uh, we lost that gamble and had to crawl, get scratched, climb, go through a lot of different terrain just to get back to where we could have walked down the road. Hopefully we'll actually hunt some boulders soon. She looks like such a scrawny oh my god. Wild. So we finally made it to a boulder. This is the thing. It's a V5. So let's hope we can get it. Ah. It's going to be uh, the only one that Dylan does for the day. He wasn't even expecting to climb. But uh, let's hope this doesn't go like the fang in the sad boulders. Let's hope I get this one. There's like two routes. I don't know if I'm like doing one route and going to the other one. Oh, what? If I had to guess, I would say probably just start on that side, yeah. Is it a jug or is that do you It's need... like a jug for one hand. <laughs>
Just below it, dude. You see? I, I can feel like the tips. Like you're getting into like, goodness. You don't want to say anything like, uh, you see it? Yeah. So since me and Dylan kind of ended up meeting up just by chance, he actually had to take off. I haven't finished this problem yet, but I think I can do it. So now I just have to reset the pads and hopefully they'll catch me if I fall. But I figured out the beta. Basically the only reason I fall in my last two attempts is because I was too tired. But I think that if I actually rest long enough, I should be able to get it. The sun's on its way down and I still haven't gotten this so far. I keep getting to the sloper match move up top and I'm just so pumped out by the time I get there. I'm gonna try to take a longer rest break. I think this is gonna be the only boulder that I try today. So I'm gonna have to try this sooner than later because turns out my headlamp is dead. And so I was planning on hiking back when it's dark, but seeing as this is my first time here and the way that we got here was not the best way. And I 
I'm not 100% sure of the way back. I need to leave while there's still sunlight. So I really hope I can get this today. I'm gonna wait a few more minutes and then give it one last try. Hopefully I'll get it and then I have to pack up and leave. Sucks, but hopefully I'll get it and then hopefully everything will be fine. <laughs> so I gave it that try and I didn't get it, but I think I figured out what I can do to make sure that I actually catch that left hand movement. So basically each time I've had my foot on uh, this chunk right here and my other foot just hanging. But I think if I get my left foot here and then get a toe hook right in here, this way I have my right foot to pull me up and my left foot to push off of and I should be able to swoop right into it. I'm gonna give it one last shot again before the sun goes down. Not a lot of recovery time. I got it. I did it. Finishing it wasn't the prettiest beta, but I did it. My toe hook beta worked, which I'm super excited about. And the sun's still out. I don't even have a lot of time to be happy and celebrate. I gotta pack up now. So I just made it back to the car. I'm exhausted. I know Missy's exhausted. This was my first time out here, so I got a little lost on the way there and on the way back, but it was fun. Now it's time for us to head home. Thanks for watching Climbing Vlog. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe so you can see the new videos that will be coming out each week. Thanks for watching Climbing Vlog. I'll see you next time.